Hey everyone, today let's dive into a topic that's as complex as it is crucial in understanding modern geopolitics, the historical conflict between Israel and Arab nations. This journey takes us back over a century, so buckle up as we traverse through time from the Ottoman Empire to today's headlines. Our story begins in the late 19th century, specifically in the late 1800s. During this era, the vast expanse of the Middle East was under the dominion of the Ottoman Empire. This was a time of relative peace, but underneath the calm, the seeds of national identities were starting to sprout among the Arab populations and the Jewish communities. Fast forward to World War I. The Great War brought profound changes as the crumbling Ottoman Empire sided with Germany. In the chaos of war, Britain saw an opportunity. The famous Balfour Declaration of 1917 promised a national home for the Jewish people in Palestine, a region predominantly inhabited by Arabs who had their aspirations for self-determination. The interwar period witnessed growing tensions. Jewish immigration increased, fueled by the horrors of anti-Semitism in Europe, most notably the rise of Nazism. Meanwhile, the Arab inhabitants of Palestine felt increasingly sidelined and threatened. This set the stage for conflict, as both groups laid historical claims to the land. By mid-20th century, the situation reached a boiling point. In 1948, following the end of British mandate in Palestine, Israel declared independence. This sparked the first in a series of Arab-Israeli wars. Neighboring Arab countries, refusing to accept a Jewish state, invaded. What ensued was a bitter and protracted conflict that reshaped the borders and the destinies of the region. The years that followed were marked by a series of wars. 1956, 1967 and 1973, each altering the geopolitical landscape. The 1967 Six Day War in particular was pivotal. Israel captured the Golan Heights, the West Bank and Gaza Strip territories that are still contentious today. Let's also touch upon the peace efforts. The 1978 Camp David Accords, a landmark in diplomatic achievements, led to a peace treaty between Egypt and Israel, the first recognition of Israel by an Arab country. The 1990s saw the Oslo Accords, which brought hopes of a lasting peace through a two-state solution. However, the road to peace has been anything but smooth, with continued settlements and intermittent conflicts casting long shadows. Today, the conflict remains one of the most intractable in the world. Each decade brings new challenges and shifts. The dynamics are influenced by global politics, regional changes, and the ever-present historical grievances and aspirations of the people directly affected. Understanding this conflict requires a deep appreciation of its historical roots and the painful complexities involved. It's a narrative of national identity, survival and the relentless pursuit of homeland woven deeply into the fabric of global history. Thank you for watching and I hope this gives you a clearer picture of the historical backdrop of the Israeli-Arab conflict. Remember, history isn't just about learning what happened but understanding the why and the how that shape our world today. Stay curious and see you in the next video.